Hey house paint friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we have a mystery houseplant unboxing sponsored by Botanicas. Botanicas has sponsored this. They will be in the description at the very top of the description if you want to go check out their shop. They sent me four plants that they claim to be very rare and I have no idea what they are. Botanicas does ship the best out of anyone I've ever seen before and you'll see why in a couple of seconds. I moved the frame just a little bit so if we're a little shifted that's why. I'm very excited uh, not only to open this but to hang out with my patrons after this today if you want to become a patreon it is the first link in the description and it helps me out so much be able to make more content for you and get to doing this full time you're all amazing and i can't wait to play animal crossing with you in like 30 minutes when we're done opening this i cut myself so many times in my life because i am bad at knives let's move the microphone just a little bit so you can kind of see the package better all right this is a very interesting box because it doesn't open anywhere from the side it only opens from right here all right there's our heat it is not warm and well it's a little warm perfect so we have this cardboard right here to keep everything in place packing peanuts raven look toys She's like literally almost on my camera. I film on top of her cat tree. Here is the first plant. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh, I'm trying to be so careful. Should we do unwrapping ASMR? I honestly think it'd be so much fun to make ASMR videos because all you're doing is just like messing around basically. Uh, it's so, like she does such a good job packaging but these are like, I'm always so scared to open them because I don't want to like accidentally like ruin the foliage. Ooh, I can't tell what it is yet. Good packaging is a blessing and a curse. Now I have to get this open. Do you guys see how thick this is? Oh my God, I think it's a jewel orchid. Oh my goodness. It is a beautiful jewel orchid. I do not know the type that it is. You'll see it on the screen right now. Here is our baby. Check that out. That is so beautiful. I love jewel orchids. I think that they're so beautiful. If you guys could see how shiny this was in person, you would die. All right, next plant. I hope that you guys are doing all right and that you're not going stir crazy. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm gonna make a smoothie so hard after this. You guys don't even know. You don't even know how hard I'm gonna make a smoothie after this. I love smoothies. They've been kind of like having smoothies instead of like ice cream or something. I almost just dropped my knife on my leg. What did I tell you guys? One of these days I'm gonna get hurt and it's gonna be on camera and it's gonna suck. I am someone who so easily gets addicted to sugar. So I'm trying to, trying to not ruin all the progress I've made while we are stuck in quarantine. Like, I'm not gonna lie. All I wanna do is eat Cheez-Its. What are you? <sighs> Anya, you snake? <laughs> she sent me. Gosh. Oh my freaking. Okay, 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 okay. This is a variegated jewel orchid. Look at that. Oh my god. These are so incredibly hard to find. These are so expensive. I never thought in a million years she would just send me one. Anya, you're so nice. Can I just say, I don't know what I did to deserve how nice you are to me, but like, oh my gosh, you are so nice. Oh, <laughs> look at her. She's so beautiful. Well, I got two beautiful little orchids here. I want to know what this one is iridescent blue and green and purple with like the red shiny veining all right we must press on we can admire the plants later there is a smoothie to be made we have the last two plants right here <sighs> wow this is so freaking exciting she just told me she sent it but like in my head in my head plant mail never arrives and you're just kind of like waiting forever you know what i mean should i make an egg today too wow all i can think about is food right now i just woke up it's like 4 18 p.m. I was up super late last night. Um, I've just been having like a hard time sleeping. I don't know if you guys have been too, but 
sleep has not been easy for me lately and especially because we have nowhere to be it's hard to just like like I'm someone that gets excited when I have free time even if I've been awake all day so if I have free time but it's like I only get to start having that free time at like 3 in the morning I'll totally just like stay up until 5 or 6 or 7 or 8 because like I want to play Animal Crossing or I want to hang out with Chris or I want to play with my cat also if you haven't watched yesterday's video go watch it Christopher and I go through Pinterest and we make him houseplant wish list super fun video <gasps> oh my god Anya shut the freaking front door knock it off this isn't funny you snake you're a snake okay I can already see what this is because it's like peeking through the packaging give me one second to get it open for you guys these were like these were like the plants that I was like, hey, something similar to this. Because the, the the plants that I, like, she's like sending me all of my top choices. Are you kidding me, Anya? Uh, I, I thought about making it um, before I shot the video, but I was just way too excited to open. Oh, that was close. I want to give you my Merlin update. So I'm on season five, I think episode two or three. Spoiler alert, skip 10 seconds ahead if you don't want to hear this. Guinevere is queen now, which is amazing because when he banished her, my heart, honestly, I honestly thought about like not watching the show anymore. And again, like I've watched the show before. I've seen all these things happen, but it was so long ago. Like I just don't even remember anything, I guess. Like I knew that she would become queen at some point, but I thought maybe that was just like in my head after he banished her. Cause I was like, well, I guess her time on the show is up. Like maybe she had another contract with another company. And so they just had to like get rid of her. But it makes me so mad, again, another spoiler alert, that she will, like, freaking Arthur will never know that it was Morgana that made her cheat on him with Lancelot. <laughs> I can't believe that Merlin didn't catch that. Everything that Merlin catches, he just didn't catch that one thing, and it just bothers me a lot. This is going to be very difficult to open without ruining these leaves. There's a reason I'm being so, uh, careful right now. This is a very delicate begonia. She sent me such a big one, too. She could have sent me a little one. Do you ever look at something? It's just so beautiful. You just want to cry. Yes. Oh, I just. Oof. I was like about to start crying, and then I rolled over the bubble wrap. <laughs> it made me laugh. Look at this. This is like one of my top wish list begonias. It has these beautiful golden leaves. They're like golden copper with these bright, like silvery yellow spots on them and the entire leaf is iridescent so like in one light you look at it and it's like kind of like orange and yellow and gold and then you tilt it in the light and it's like bright red sparkles it's so incredible i can't wait to put it in my begonia enclosure it's just stuff on the ground and boxings are so much fun but they make so much work for me to clean up oh my gosh i just like so many rare plants just like sitting here and I don't even know what's in this one yet. Wow, I'm like, I'm honestly just like about to cry because of how, just like the generosity, like she could have sold these plants and made so much money, but she just sent them to me to be nice. Like, Anya, you are so sweet and I hope that one day I can repay you for all the kindness you've shown me. Okay, here's our last one don't know what is in here how are you guys liking this mystery unboxing thing i this is the second mystery unboxing i have done i want to do more i think it's super fun to have plants show up and not know what's in them i think the mystery box things are super fun on youtube animal crossing is great Your girls loaded i have like i think 65 650 thousand. there we go that's what i meant to say things are going great uh the tarantula market is booming i have one customer their name is flick and they will give me so much money so i'm just collecting tarantulas and then selling them so that way i can just like upgrade all my stuff all at once and if i want to make a bridge or an incline like i can just do that making my own tarantula island is the best thing in the world if you guys haven't tried it yet you gotta it's seriously a lifesaver when it comes to the finances in that game are we ready I'm excited to finish Merlin I think I'll probably end up finishing it either today just from binge watching because it's a Saturday and I like to watch it while I play Animal Crossing or tomorrow so either way the show's gonna be over for me in two days and I am sad because I, I really like that show so much what the heck is this I have never seen this before. It looks like it's a begonia. I can't see it too well. Wow, this knife is so good. What are you? This, I 
wish I wish she sent me a list. I mean, I know she doesn't probably want to spoil the surprise by me reading the list early. So my camera died and I never got to film this part, but I just wanted to say why I love this begonia. I really like how its veins are literally like, they look like human blood veins. And it just has this massive silver spot on it. It's very similar to my begonia burkillii. And I love the way that its leaves are very similar to the begonia Darth Vidariana. It's so, Good. I hope that you guys enjoyed this mystery houseplant unboxing. Let me know if you'd like to see more mystery ho houseplant unboxings in the future. I can always, of course, pay a random amount and then ask them to send me something that fits in that amount. If you like these mystery unboxings, let me know. Let me know where you'd like to see mystery unboxings from. And thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and tweet me at PlantMeAshley. Let me know if you had any questions, comments, concerns, and if you'd like to go get some of these plants for yourself, head on over to etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash botanicas with a z at the end to take a look at these plants for your very self now be warned botanicas does specialize in exotic begoniaceae begoniaceae which is just like exotic very rare begonias the prices on their shop are more expensive but that is because she puts so much care into these plants and they are all very very hard to come by plants she also has some less expensive plants on her on her shop so go ahead and check it out it's fun to even just go look at their shop so go take a go take a look go take a look let me know what you guys think let me know if you guys are adding anything to your wish list i do have a patreon so if you want to support me on patreon it helps so much during these harder times i have five categories each of them comes with their own stackable benefits stackable benefits the one dollar category gets your name on the end card that you're seeing right now and the three dollar and up categories get you in the discord where we have an animal crossing community a wish list channel we have a, a general chat where i'm free to talk all the time we have a buy sell trade chat song sharing chat we've got a couple different voice chat rooms if you want to talk to people about different topics it's a whole community we just upgraded our discord too so a lot of cool things are happening come join come check it out come be a patron and help me make it to being able to do this full time <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching i hope that you loved seeing these beautiful begonias and jewel orchids i will see you in the next houseplant section bye <laughs> someone take me houseplant shopping i'm dying here